Hey gamers. The first choice you make in Kingdom Hearts is related to your build. This is represented by three weapons, the sword, shield, and staff. The game is pretty clear about what your choices mean here. You pick one to be a focus and one to sacrifice. The sword represents a melee focus. The shield represents a focus on defense. The staff represents a focus on magic. While each weapon possesses a focus on its respective category, that doesn't mean Sora will be severely lacking in the category of the weapon he sacrifices. By first selecting a weapon, Sora's attack, defense, or magic attributes will be boosted to start the game. Sacrificing one of the remaining two means his stats for that category will just be slightly lowered. Also, Sora's maximum inventory capacity will be affected by which weapons he chosses and sacrifices. Taking the initial hit on either attack or magic attributes isn't the end of the world. Because when you hit Traverse Town, Donald and Goofy will join up with Sora. Having those two contribute with their own physical and magical attacks will offset Sora's slight offensive deficiencies. After you've ultimately made your decisions, it's time for Sora to explore his home of Destiny Islands, where more tests await. That's all for now. Thank you so much for watching. Like if you like it. Dislike it you dislike it. And subscribe if you subscribed it.